friends yes uh, i'm continuing the topic uh, that is uh, jsp components so let's see after uh, architecture of uh, jsp or uh, jsp engine let's see uh, the concept called uh, jsp components okay or you can call it as the structure of uh, jsp page uh, jsp page contains uh, what are the different elements like that or statements okay or you can call it as uh, components so jsp or comprised as standard html tags and uh, jsp tags so the structure of jsp page is simple and easy handled by a servlet engine okay so how the servlet engine will uh, uh, executed easily means so the, which it has a jsp will has the following uh, uh, component that is called directives declarations scriptlets comments expressions okay the main important point uh, that is called first one uh, which it is called uh, directives right so directives uh, means like uh, it is a this is a tag uh, which it is used for uh, defining the functions okay and variables to be used in the jsp so here this element of uh, jsp contains uh, java variables and uh, methods uh, which you can call in uh, expression block of uh, jsp page okay and uh, declarations are defined by using uh, like these symbols okay which it has like uh, percentage and uh, uh, you can use like uh, x matri mark and uh, uh, percentage okay and uh, tags okay which it uh, the decl uh, declarations are defined by using uh, those uh, different tags okay uh, i i'll given i given a syntax also which it has like this and uh, whatever you declare within these tags will be visible to the rest of the page okay so let's see uh, here uh, we'll have like uh, another one so you can able to import packages and uh, you can define uh, here error handling uh, pages or uh, session information uh, of the jsp okay uh, which it is defined by using uh, like this add, add symbol or you can able to use like uh, explanatory mark like that for declarations okay let's see uh, another point uh, you can have like uh, that jsp directives will provide uh, directions and uh, instruction to the container that uh, how to handle certain aspects of uh, jsp processing okay uh, you can able to give uh, from where to where you have to uh, move uh, one to other like that you can able to uh, provide directions uh, for that so for this you can use like uh, this uh, like direct to uh, component okay for this you have to specify uh, attribute equal to value like that okay uh, let's see another one uh, which it is called uh, a scriptlets okay before that we will see what are the different directives are there so there are uh, three types of directives one is page directive and uh, include directive and tag library directive okay so mainly uh, this uh, page directive means it defines a page dependent attributes such as uh, scripting language or error pages and buffering requirements okay if you want to add uh, different scripts javascript or uh, php I, I mean whatever the scripts related uh, uh, languages are there or source code is there you can able to add in that and in the in the in this position by specifying like this tag and if you want to add error pages for example if you are if you are creating one login form at the time if if login fails what you have to display and if you are uh, accessing a database values and at the time if if the database values is not there or if data database is not connected to that that which it displays error pages right so you you can able to uh, link that pages in uh, this page directives okay by using this uh, this this syntax okay and and one more thing one more example like uh, if you are uh, creating one project uh, sign in project at the time if the file is not found you will get one page error right file is not found or page is not found like that you will get an error that type of error pages also you can able to uh, uh, write in uh, this syntax okay and one more thing that is called in include okay include error to nothing but which it uh, the during the translation phase you can able to add uh, uh, I include files here okay and uh, tag library files means uh, if you want to define your own uh, tag library like uh, an actions like uh, what you have to perform in that you can able to add custom uh, actions here okay so let's see uh, one more uh, thing that is called uh, one more component called uh, declarations so declarations uh, means actually uh, this is a tag uh, which is used to defining the functions and variables uh, to be used in jsp okay this element of uh, jsp contains uh, java variables so if you want to declare variables like methods uh, you, if you want to call in expression block at the time you can able to declare values here by using a, a percentage explanatory mark and a declaration so you can use like integer i equal to 10 like that 
or uh, our string name equal to so and so like that you can declare like that this is a declaration part so each and every component will have specific rules okay based on that rule only you have to design your uh, jsp page or jsp code okay and let's see uh, one more thing that is called scriptlets okay in this tag we can able to insert any amount of valid uh, java code okay this is a major important code which you, have, you can able to place a uh, uh, jsp service method uh, by uh, by the jsp engine which it has okay and mainly it is used anywhere you can place anywhere uh, the script you can place anywhere in the uh, jsp page okay uh, which it is defined by using a percentage uh, less than percentage and scriptlets you have to write there okay and let's see another uh, thing that is uh, comments okay for comments uh, this is a second uh, uh, first one here you can have like you can specify like this in html format and uh, uh, second type of comment is not delivered to the browser why because it is written in using a uh, here uh, like this a percentage uh, like this okay so this is a major uh, main important uh, syntax for uh, jsp pages so which it helps uh, here comments will help to understanding uh, what is actually code doing and it provides two types of comments for putting comment in your page first type comment is for output uh, comment and which it is appeared in the output screen of the browser and it will be it is written in uh, like this okay like uh, here first i specify right that is the first uh, comment okay and second comment you can able to use a percentage like that okay and one more thing one more component that is called expression uh, it, 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 yeah, expression in jsp is used to output any data or like uh, if you want to add like uh, any expression like uh, a plus b or uh, an expression related uh, terminology code if you want to write then you can use uh, expressions uh, uh, component okay so these data are automatically converted to string and printed on the output stream so it, it is an instruction to the web container that it will execute what i have to do uh, which it has like that okay uh, what the values for writing an expression you can use like percentage uh, equal to equal to expression okay for example a equal to 10 uh, you can use where you have to use means uh, in first definition uh, there is a declaration part you can able to use right uh, and one more expression means expression here you can use like uh, a plus b equal to uh, the value the sum value okay so let's see one example then you can able to understand easily uh, don't worry uh, stay tuned and uh, then i'll see one more uh, concept 